Getting out and getting groceries can be somewhat challenging these days, but imagine if there was the thick blanket of snow on the ground. Travis Lee shows us what that's like. We hit the grocery store first and pick up everything that we need um, just so that we have all of that already and don't have to go back to the store. And then we just make stops along the way, um, giving the dogs breaks in between. Good job, guys. Focus, baby. Anna Lucas, her fiance, and another kennel helper, along with 12 dogs, are picking up groceries and medical supplies for elderly and other COVID-19 vulnerable people in Arusta County, traveling between 50 and 75 miles a day on sled. They're really thankful, um, and they're so excited to see me and the dogs um, whenever I uh, show up with the groceries. Lucas has raced in the Can-Am Crown sled dog race the past two years, and her generosity is also a good workout for her team. They're really conditioned dogs. They're used to having about 300 pounds total in the sled, so the, the bags of groceries don't really compare to, like, the bags of sand that I use to train them before the racing season starts. As long as there's snow on the ground, Lucas will keep delivering, she says. She's hoping that will be until the end of April. It was snowing in Caribou this morning. I don't think I would have seen myself doing this, um, but uh, things are changing really fast, and I just want to be able to, like, help mitigate, um, make things a little easier for people.